that uh, this is a commission that is established uh, in our constitution uh, under chapter 15 and as such if it need to be disbanded then it can only be through the constitution and therefore I want to invite the members particularly those who have not spoken on the motion of the constitution amendment and starting order changes it's time I think when they are contributing because honorable speaker I happen to have spoken to make this recommendation also in their debate that in this constitution amendment we are debating here in the house we may need also to make an amendment in that chapter 15 which is the uh, founding chapter of this commission and way option of either disbanding it or making its mandate clearer because when an employee since SRC is also an employee honorable speaker works outside his mandate steps other people's mandate there can only be two three things one either this commission has no capacity otherwise why are they working outside their mandate two either this commission has bad faith and three this commission simply just want to make populist uh, statements to the media i don't know for what reason but i just consider them as populist honorable speaker having said that there are so many institutions of the same kind the tsc we have the judiciary and many other commissions including the parliamentary service commission so one commission cannot redefine the agreement of an employee between an employee and an employer this they cannot and i am just thinking that if they are doing that which is not given to them through the articles that guide them then it is time that this house consider that cost they spend so many hours they are paid so much allowances and they do the wrong job who pays for this cost this is kenyan taxpayers money honorable speaker either they should refund this money or else work for free and work rightfully because they cannot be spending money working they are paid and they do not perform the duty in accordance to the law honorable speaker as i conclude because many people have spoken many members have spoken on the same i want to say that SRC cannot prefect other commissions. At the same time, they cannot also have the ill motive to try to show the public that there are certain people who are given free money. No one is given free money in this country. Everyone works for the money one is paid for. Honorable member, one of the contributors have spoken of the experience. I think Honorable Wangwe. There are members here who are serving for the term, fifth the term, and a member who came here during his first term was paid a uh, Kenya shillings XX. The previous term, he was pocketing XX. Then he come, then the money is reduced. Really, is this commission aware of what they are doing? Is it ethical? Is it moral? I think it is not. So for us to cure this bad faith, um, Englishman says that uh, idle man is devil's workshop. I think in the beginning this commission was working part time, but this house approved they work full time. So I'm imagining they have so much time and they are idle, and that is why they have to go to all employees from all quarters in Kenya. So this house should now resolve that they go back to part time, they work on part time basis.